Welcome to Aurora Chemistry for everyone. Let us balance the given equations. Zinc plus silver nitrate gives zinc nitrate plus silver. It is a word equation. So first let us convert it into skeletal equation. So for zinc, the symbol of zinc is written. For silver nitrate, it is a compound. See how the formula of silver nitrate is formed here. You can see silver and nitrate ions are attached together. When their charges are crisscrossed, we get silver nitrate. So let us write that formula of silver nitrate AgNO3. That gives zinc nitrate. What is the formula of zinc nitrate? So zinc and nitrate ions are attached together. When their charges crisscrossed, we get the formula of zinc nitrate ZnO3 twice. Okay, plus silver Ag. In this equation, you can see there is a presence of polyatomic ions, nitrate ions. That is also both in left hand side and right hand side, it is present without any disturbance in their structure. So, we can take it as a single unit. So, first, first let us write left hand side and right hand side. The reactants are in left hand side and the products are in the right hand side. So, first uh, let us write that elements in the left hand side one by one. So, for zinc it is only one. For silver also only one. Nitrate it is a polyatomic ion but we are going to take it as a single unit here. So, let us write NO3. So, that is also only one unit. The same order let us follow in the right hand side. So, for zinc only one. Then for silver only one. For nitrate you can see there are two nitrate groups are attached to zinc. Isn't it? So, let us write two. Now, just you draw a column in between left hand side atoms and right hand side atoms to find the difference. See, if you write the difference and then if you go for balancing the equation, you will get the accurate answer. So, to find the difference between left hand side atoms of zinc and right hand side atoms of zinc, 1 minus 1 that gives 0. Then for silver, in the left hand side it is only 1, In even in right hand side also 1, so 1 minus 1, again we get 0. But for nitrate, you can see in the right hand side 2, in the left hand side only 1, so 2 minus 1, 1. But until we get 0 in difference column for all the elements, we try to balance. So to make for nitrate group in the left hand side 2, let us multiply with 2. Let us multiply with 2. This 2 as a coefficient, we are going to put it in front of chemical formula of silver nitrate. See, by writing 2 in the front of AgNO3, now the atoms of silver also changing into 2. So, 1 we cut and write 2. Let us write the differences now for nitrate 2 minus 2. So, we got 0 now, but for silver, there is a difference, isn't it? So, 0 we cut and we write 1. So, to make it into 0, so in that the right hand side of the silver, we need to multiply with 2. So, this 2 as a coefficient in the front of silver, we go to put. Now, find the difference 2 minus 2 again 0. So, now we got 0 for all the elements in difference column. Let us check once again left hand side atoms and right hand side atoms to check their numbers. So, for zinc, right hand side also 1. For silver, left hand side 2 and right hand side also 2. For nitrate, left hand side 2 and for right hand side also 2. So, it is completely balanced. Now, we can write the answer. Button plus 2 g 3 gives 
zinc nitrate is at an NO3 twice plus 2 Hg. Thanks for watching.